Hey dolls, welcome back to my channel. How is everybody doing today? I missed you guys. I'm finally back with another video. To today I have this really pretty wing liner with a red lippy. I posted a picture on my Facebook a while back and um, some of you guys were asking how I get my curly hair like this. Um, and I wanted to show you guys, so I did a two-in-one video for you guys. Um, so I'll be doing my makeup and I'll be doing my hair as well. So like a mini tutorial, also updating you guys on what's been going on, why I haven't been posting, if I'm working, if I'm not working. Um, so anyway, um, if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. If you've already been here, welcome back. Thank you for tuning in. I really appreciate really appreciate your guys' support so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video um and yeah so if you want to see how i got this look on the face and this hair please keep on watching so i'm gonna go ahead and get started i already have my brows done as you can see um i'm not i'm gonna try not to take so much time on my face because i really want to show you guys how i get my hair like that but we're gonna go ahead and get started i'm gonna go in with my hemp and rose Well, let's just get right into it. I'm sorry I haven't been consistent on my um on my YouTube channel. I just been busy doing some other stuff, which I'm definitely gonna fill you guys in on it. But I started a new project. Um, on the new project, I don't want to fill you guys in so much, just because I have a whole vlog coming on that. Um, so if anything, just excuse me on that part, but I will be telling you guys other updates and stuff. So I'm going to take just a, a light color or just like a color to put on my, give my eyes a little bit of color just because I'm going to do that winged liner. So I am no longer working as some of you guys know, or have you been watching my vlogs? If you haven't, you have to turn to my other channel my vlog channel i was working i no longer have a job um it was just easier for me to not have one because of other projects that i'm working on and just overall it was easier for me to just stop working on top of that my daughter and i got sick and just so much happened within that time I was just like okay I gotta I got to I got to like I have to stop working so um I am no longer working so I'm just gonna put in a shade kind of gonna take it all the way to the top of my brow I do want a little bit of color we are gonna do just a winged liner so just one shade of color will work just like that For the eyeliner, I'm going in with the e.l.f., my favorite eyeliner from e.l.f. Okay, um, I already did my eyeliner. This one's a little bit on the thicker side, but I am going to clean it with my concealer. I'm going to pop on some lashes, so I'm just going to put a little bit of mascara on. And for mascara, I'm going in with the Mega Wild, or sorry, Mega Wear from Wet n Wild. I have a new project. Um, I'll be posting a full vlog on there, so that's how come I'm not telling you guys much about the project. Um, but I'm really excited, that's what I should say. But it does take a lot of my time, so we are looking more into areas of where we want to live and purchase a house. Um, we kind of want to do that already, but we just gotta kind of wait because we did sign a lease. So, um, we're just kind of waiting on that, but... I'm excited. Colorado has been great. It's been treating us really nicely. The weather is different, definitely. Okay, so for my moisturizer and um, at the same time um, primer, I'm going to in go in with a Dr. Denise Skin Science. You already know. So I'm going to go ahead and pop on my lashes real quick. Okay, so I'm gonna go in now with my e.l.f. Um, foundation. Um, 
Ooh, I put the I put the whole thing on one side. Um, so yeah, as I was saying, so we've been looking at areas where we want to get our house. Um, that's going to be a vlog too. So I don't want to give too much, but I definitely do want to tell you guys what's going on. I'll definitely update you guys with that. I'm gonna go in with the instant age rewind I love this concealer and I'm just going to apply it also new update I am a great auntie to a baby girl finally I have um, three great nephews Okay, so for powder, I'm going to go in with the Laura Mercier. So I'm going to leave on a little bit, but I like to dust off the bottom quickly. I don't want it to look so cakey. All right, now I'm going to apply a little bit of bronzer. For blush, I'm gonna go in with this e.l.f. one. lipstick I'm gonna go in with this red one hi girl okay you guys so I just added that red lipstick I really like it you can add any red lipstick that you like so now I'm gonna go in with this NYX long pencil eye and light brown and I'm just going to line my waterline. Okay guys, so now I'm going to add some mascara. There it is, dollies. We got the makeup look done. Now we're gonna go ahead and do the hair. So I wanna back the camera up a little bit so you can see because my hair is pretty down to here. So my on. hair is very thin. So if I had a lot more hair, it would look a lot fuller. That's why I really don't straighten my hair a lot because if I straighten it, I feel like it looks a lot thinner. So for me, curls makes my hair, my hair feel like I have a lot more. What I like to do is I will take the bottom so now if you have a lot of hair, I would recommend for you to do bigger curls. If you have thin hair like me, then you would do little or, or thinner curls um, so that your hair could look fuller, okay? So I just take a chunk from the bottom and literally in like three halves I could finish because I have very thin hair, very little bit of, I have like Bien poquito pelo. So if you have a lot of hair, definitely do it in sections. But anyway, I'm going to use this Con Air wand. So as you can see, it's like thicker on the bottom and it doesn't have to be, you can use any wand. Um, honestly, the thicker ones work as well. You're gonna wrap thin hair on it. The thicker it is, the thinner you want it to be. Um, so anyway, I just take a piece of hair like this much and then I put my wand and I wrap it. So for example, I'm going to be doing this one one way, the other one I'm going to do the opposite way. So you're going to do one and one and one and one. That way you don't, I don't know how to explain it, but I'll show you right now. Okay, so I just leave it on for a couple of seconds and then boom, I let it go. Did that one that way, so this one I'm going to do this way. Okay, how the hell? Okay, so for this one, I'm gonna go in because I went in backwards with the other one. Do you know what I mean? So see, you want them to look like quinceanera hairs. And then again. 
So see, my hair is so thin, it literally takes me like four of these to get it done. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I have done the whole bottom piece. As you can see, um, they're just all kind of together. Some are one direction and the others are in a different direction. That way they don't gather up. You're gonna take another section of hair. So like I said, I can finish off in like three sections, but if you want it, the, f the fuller you want it to look, the less sections and the thinner you want it to be, so. Like I said, one in, one out. I'm not really splitting them or anything like that, right? Okay, you guys, so I'm all done. Now I'm just gonna go in and look for little pieces of hair that I'm missing, like for example, this one, and in no particular way or order, just curl it. You want it to all be curled. It don't matter how it look, how it look, how it looks. And then look in the back and make sure that all your hair is curled. The way to do it is you take another near and you kind of just check out the back. It's better if you do it the other way, but mm -hmm. okay. So now that you have your hair like that, sorry, you guys, I really need to get my makeup beauty room situated so in no particular way I mean you can split it the way you want to if you do it down the middle or if you want to do it sideways it's totally up to you personally I like it sideways but I'm going to show you what I do next so now that you have it looking like quinceanera hair like this you're going to take your favorite hairspray I'm going to use some aquanet now, first gotta paint on your eyebrows spray your hair with aquanet get a okay so anyway, I'm gonna take a little bit of hairspray and I'm just gonna like, so just a little bit, just like that to make it a little like crunchy. And then take your favorite dry shampoo to give it texture. I'm gonna use this Dove Refreshing Care um, Volume and Fullness Dry Shampoo. I can't remember where I got this from. It's just like a little sample. Okay. So after it's done like that, now you're gonna just take your hands and you're gonna kind of comb it out with your manos, just like so. Just work your fingers through it to make it like puffy and voluminous. Okay, and now at this point you can um, split it the way you want. So for example, if you like it like this or However you like it, you know, you can split it down the middle. You can put this to the back like so, and then just kind of, you know, whatever you want. I personally like it like, <laughs> I personally like it like this. This is how I get my hair to look curly, full, and like with a lot of volume because I have very thin hair this is the final look you guys okay dolls i hope that you guys enjoyed this video with a really simple winged liner and red lip um and just curly hair it feels so good it feels bouncy um this is how i get my voluminous curly hair i hope that you guys enjoyed the video i will list all the products that i use for my hair down below in the description box and um yeah Hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you next time.